In our last tech tip, we learned how to set up a TGA mass spec experiment and had a basic introduction to the software. In this tech tip, we will introduce the easy view mode and two windows which will be very important to the basic operation of your discovery mass spec. Start by clicking on the start easy view button. Select the instrument to connect to. This menu appears. There are two icons that allow us to access the bar chart and peak jump trend modes. Choose this icon to activate the bar chart mode. This will display a real-time scan of the ions being detected by the mass spectrometer. Set the threshold for where you expect to do your analysis. We have 1 times 10 to the minus 2 entered here. The ion mass range can also be changed by using the arrows to increase or decrease the range. You can also simply enter a number in the box for the upper limit. Now we are scanning from mass 1 to 100 atomic mass units. What we see is the background atmosphere as the furnace is open to the air. What's most important is that there are no ions being detected above 50 atomic mass units or Daltons. These ions would likely be associated with contamination from previous experiments indicating that the instrument or possibly the TGA needs cleaning or a bake out. Enable the peak jump trend mode by clicking on this icon. You will see a plot of the total pressure versus elapsed time. Notice that several ions are selected by default and these are the ions associated with the atmosphere. Mass 44 is carbon dioxide, mass 40 is argon, Mass 32 is oxygen, mass 28 is nitrogen, mass 18 is water, mass 4 is helium, common carrier gas, and mass 2 is hydrogen. You will see these plot as a function of elapsed time, and within a few minutes you will have a representation of the relative concentration of each of these gases. An easy check for the detector response is to breathe into the TGA furnace and check for the response of mass 44 and mass 18 associated with carbon dioxide and water. You should see an immediate jump in these relative concentrations. In this tech tip, we introduce the easy view mode as well as the bar chart and peak jump trend windows. In our next tech tip, we will expand upon the use of these windows to ensure that our discovery mass spectrometer is performing properly.